All right, so I've attempted to film this video I, like more than five times and I'm really struggling to film it because I joke around too much or I forget certain details so I'm sorry um yeah anyways I want to quickly apologize for not uploading for a month the thing is I'm lazy I will pre-record and edit a video and then forget about it and when I look at it I'm like ill this video is disgusting and I'll just delete it completely so I'm sorry about that um also all my social medias are down below so if you want to uh, stay up to date with what I'm doing with my life then go ahead and follow me if you want um I think that's about it yeah um so let's get started so today we're gonna be talking about my heart and I'm, I'm sorry about that ring I'm not quite sure where it's coming from so just ignore it anyways so when I was about three days old my mom was getting ready to get discharged from the hospital she was packing her things up and all that and she noticed that I wasn't really breathing correctly so she told the nurses and the nurses were like oh that's fine that's just how newborn babies are you know when they're like fresh out the womb they just don't breathe correctly so a doctor passed by and noticed I wasn't breathing correctly and I was kind of a little bit purple and he told my mom like I wouldn't make it through the night like I would die if I went home with her so he did a few tests on me he did an EKG and an echo and he was like that he found out that I had a rare heart condition um, which is called double outlet right ventricle VSD C aortic stenosis no subaortic sorry I always get that mixed up um, subaortic stenosis basically double outlet right ventricle is all my ventricles are on the right side of my heart um, VSD is like my VSD is bigger than usual like it's a big hole I have a big hole in my heart literally um, and then sub subaortic stenosis is something with the electrical part of my heart yeah anyways so I had three open heart surgeries basically when I was 17 days old I had my first heart surgery when I was six months old I had my second and then when I was three I had my third heart surgery I've also I have a stent and I've done a few catheterizations um, yeah what else the, so like one side of my heart is working more than the other so it's like 60 40 and then the I don't have really have a lot of oxygen going into my heart yeah which kind of sucks but um, and the blood from my lungs is mixing with the blood from my heart which isn't good yeah basically like the hospital is just like where I've always been half of my life like it's like my second home which I know I should it's like kind of bad to say but I mean I know all the nurses there and everything yeah and I'm pending for my fourth surgery it's actually been pending for quite some time now um, the reason I haven't done it yet is because if I do my surgery here like where I live the they would have to like put a pacemaker on me because they would be messing with the electrical part of my heart and I don't need a pacemaker which is why my doctors want me to do it in Boston but um, if I do it in Boston I mean my heart would be completely normal not completely I mean they'll still have its little like, unique differences from other certain hearts but yeah I personally don't want to do my heart surgery because I just really love my heart the way it is and I don't want to change anything about it but I know I need the surgery so yeah um, also I'm not allowed to like be active and like do certain things because it could like really mess up my heart more than it's already messed up and I'm actually supposed to be like on a ventilator with like feeding tubes and things like that but thank god like I'm not and everything's alright um, I take medication every day for my heart and my asthma and a whole bunch of things so yeah and basically that's my heart story I'm sorry if I left anything out because I'm pretty sure I 
most likely did. I always forget certain details, but that's basically my heart story. Um, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys whenever with another video. If you would like to, my social medias are down below, so you can go follow me. Um, yeah, don't forget to hit the subscribe button right below this video and the bell right next to it so it notify you every time I make new videos. Um, yeah, goodbye. Thanks for watching. So I completely forgot, but shout out to Dark Panda Studios for retweeting my tweet. Um, yeah. <laughs>